Oh my god, this update is insane! What's going on boys? Welcome back to another Creative Destruction video. So this video boys, this update is actually insane. This update is gonna improve FPS and it's got so much more as well. So make sure you check out the rest of this video because it is amazing. As always, you know me, 500 diamond giveaway every single video. All you have to do is pop a comment down below. Go ahead right now and pop a comment right down below. Hit a like on the video, subscribe, and I'll pick a random comment. One of those random comments down below to win 500 free diamonds. All you have to do is get the likes over 500. Easy as that, boys. So, without further ado, let's get in the video. Yeah. Baby, girl, you're so damn fine, no Wanna know if I can hit it from behind, though I'm sipping on you like some fun wine, though When it's over, I press rewind, though Talking bands, I got it Benjamins in my pocket I him. Okay, so boys This week's update Let's check it out You know the routine Sick Okay, guys, so we're going to check out the patch notes, see exactly what Creative Destruction developers are going to be adding into this Thursday's update. Let's see how good it is. Okay, here we go. So, number one, many explorers have reported that the sound effects radius of vehicles is too small, making, it su making sudden vehicle raids a major concern. After careful consideration and repeated adjustments, we have decided to increase the distance at which vehicle sound effects can be heard. Now vehicles coming from afar can now more easily be detected by explorers through sound cues. Let's go! So boys, as you know, it was a massive ball ache because sometimes you, you can't hear a vehicle until it's literally right next to you and literally you just get run over and that's the end of your game, you're dead. So literally, that's good. They're fixing bugs finally, so that's amazing. So let's get on to number two. We have now removed the cyclone effect that appears in the middle of the poison circle near the end of each battle to prevent it from impacting your vision. Ooh, so they, you know the tornado at the end of the zone, boys? It looks like they've removed it, which, I mean, it's good, that's kind of good and bad because the good thing is... Um, obviously, yeah, it doesn't affect your vision anymore, the big tornado in the way. The second thing is, that I mean, the bad thing is that, obviously, you don't know where the zone is shrinking to. So it's, it can be random wherever the circle, like, shrinks to at the end. Because it always shrinks under the cyclone tornado. So, ooh, that's pretty good. Um, we'll have to see how that, do, how that goes. So, number three, you can now see floating damage text when spectating. That's pretty cool. That makes it easier to see how much damage people are doing to each other when you're spectating in sort of a custom game or playground mode. Um, number four, built panels can now be edited by teammates. What the hell? What? De developers, what the hell is going on? What? Who? Who's taken over? Who? What the hell? Who the hell has taken over the CDHQ? Like, what the hell? Why are all these bugs being fixed now? What the hell? Next, the Land of Wonder. As you can't complete Season Pass and daily missions in the Land of Wonder, we have removed the Mission Tracking button from the Land of Wonder interface to prevent causing inconvenience. Okay. Don't know what that means. Uh, CD Showdown is still going on. That's just basically, uh, yeah, 500 Explorers, blah, blah, blah. 80 people get into the semis. Put from the line for the crown for 5,000. Stop inviting me, goddammit! The CD Showdown semi-finals will take place on the September 21st, which is next week, guys. So don't miss it. I'm going to be streaming it as well. I have qualified for both US and Med Server, so I'm going to be streaming it. So make sure you check that out. Number one, the all-new accessory type streamer is now available in the store. After equipping a streamer, whether parachuting through the sky, dashing across the battlefield, or even standing around in a lobby with your teammates, a dazzling stream will always follow you behind, lighting up where you go. What? This week, many fine streamers, including a turquoise streamer, will be available for purchase in the store. Streamers can be found in packs and can also be purchased directly. What? So they're adding, like, some sort of streamline behind you when you're walking and when you're, like, shooting off into, like, in, like an, an egg chair in an ejection seat in a springboard. So 
It looks like you're going to have some sort of effect coming from behind you. And it looks like there's going to be loads of different ones to choose from as well. So that's that's freaking awesome. I'm not going to lie. Uh, number two, the all new look, the shockwave is now available in the store. The power of lightning is mine to command. Wherever you go, the storm shall follow. Cool. Number three, they've optimized pop-up logic of advertisement in the store. If you already own the look in an advertisement, the corresponding advertisement will no longer pop up. Okay. Oh, that's pretty cool, actually. So, guys, as you know, the, the, the freaking mall is literally, like, clustered. Like, there's so many stuff to choose from. Like, look at all these. Like, what do I even choose from? So, basically, any skins that you've already got, guys, basically, they're not going to show in the store. So, you, obviously, you don't need them twice. If you sell them, they'll probably pop up back in the store. So, that's pretty cool. Uh, what else? They've adjusted the game's login page. The game's login page now looks cooler than ever. Wow. What the hell's going on? I'm scared. Developers. Number two, they've added a claim all button to the season pass interface so you can quickly and conveniently claim all of your rewards at once. Makes it easier. Number three, when you are in the item preview interface, an item will be marked as owned if you already own that item. Cool. Number four, the advanced items in the season pass will now be assigned an obvious background colour to show the corresponding quality of the item. Cool. Number five, when there are items available to be claimed from the season pass reward interface, a small red dot will now appear correctly, so you won't get like notification dots around your fingers. I know I get annoyed with that, like stuff like this behind me right here like little notification dots that you want to get rid of and you just can't get rid of so yeah uh number five with uh oh, sorry number one oh other optimizations they fixed a bug in which the sound effects of sound interface might fail okay number two in order to ensure smoother gameplay on low spec devices if you choose smooth graphical quality look items will no longer have physic effects wait Wait, there isn't a smooth... <gasps> whoa, whoa, whoa. Are they adding a smooth graphics effect to improve FPS? Oh my god, they are. This update's insane! So they're adding a new smooth graphic quality, guys, in the settings. So you've only got low, normal, high, and ultra at the moment. They're going to be adding a smooth one. Which obviously would improve FPS because it would... I mean, the game wouldn't look as good, I don't think. I don't know. It, it gets rid of physic effects, whatever that means. So they're going to be adding a new smooth graphic quality to boost FPS. Let's go! Finally, boys! They finally... They're finally, like, improving the game. Let's go! Oh, my God. Literally, boys. Type in the frigging comments right now if you are hyped for that. This Thursday, tomorrow, they're going to be adding a smooth effect. Yes! Let's go! Ah. So that's basically it, boys. It's only going to be a short video today. No gameplay, unfortunately. I'm going to release another video tomorrow when the update is out. So make sure you tune in then. Remember, 500 diamond giveaway. All you have to do right now, just pop a comment down below. Go on, write one. You can type anything you want. Type hashtag new map, whatever you like. Hit a like, get them over 500, and I will pick a random comment down below to win 500 free diamonds. And remember, boys, this weekend coming up, we have the semi-finals for the CD Showdown. So do not miss it. And another special announcement, boys. Tonight, 8 p.m. UK time. So sort that out, whatever time frame you're in. 8 p.m. UK time. I'm going to be hosting a pre-warm-up CD showdown event. So it's going to be me and one pro player. I'm going to be streaming on the official CD page and we're going to be playing eight games. I'm going to be picking four random people to join in that game. It's going to be me and this pro player versus the other four players. If they can beat us two, they will win diamond coupons and there's going to be eight games. So there's going to be different teams that are going to be rotating in every single one. So do not miss the stream tonight. 8 p.m. UK time. Sort that out. I'll see you in the next video. Yeah, boy! Gila.